Hey everyone, and thanks for tuning in to this Hammer Pattern End of 9th Edition Mega Battle Battle Report. To celebrate the release of 10th Edition, we got together with the Hammer Pattern team and our friends to throw down with 6,000 points of Imperial Forces versus 6,000 points of Chaos and Zenos. Six players, 2,000 points per player. It's pretty exciting, so come check it out. Split into two forces. The Xenos and Chaos have deployed upon opposing flanks. Imperial forces deployed first, protecting their central objective with a world-ending weapon of cataclysmic power. With Custodes and Mechanicus taking up the bulk of the central defense, while the sisters decided to deploy and stem the tide against the Xenos. The Tyranids deployed in full force a massive mob of bio-monstrosities ready to consume biomass for the hive mind. While the Drakari were a little bit more reserved, hiding the webway and waiting for the perfect moment to strike. What's that coming over the hill? Dramatically. Is it a monster? Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh shit, the destruction. Oh no, oh, no. Ah, Camera shake. Ah. Ah. Over the turns, the grinding advance of the Chaos Knights could not be stopped by the Mechanicum Servitors. The grim servants of the Dark Gods smashed through their lines without relent. Dice just weren't with me this day. I tried and tried and just couldn't bring down any knights until the last turn. And here we have the mighty Gertrude and in combat. Out. The sister of Repentia are here on the battlefield in their leather clad forms. No. The mighty Gertrude, however, is too large for the boxes. I am David Attenborough. Bye. <laughs> on the other side of the battle, Drukari streaked across the battlefield alongside Tyranid bioweapons corralled like a wrecking ball into the lines of the Sisters of Battle. We got to see some great classic 9th edition moments, squads of Repentia fighting on death and almost single-handedly killing a Tyranid Hierophant. Correction there, Lane. The Repentia did indeed kill Gertrude. 26 inches. Oh my as, god, Gertrude just Gertrude's blew up. Back, overlo it's overloading its brain. It's gonna do d6 mortal wounds to everything. Onager. One. Damn. Two. Ah, oh, just killed it. This lady. Okay. She's one one. Two. Yeah, can you pass me that? That lady. Four. Can you pass me that model? That lady. Six. Pass me that model. <laughs> <laughs> Drukari succubi tearing through a tank like paper and then dying from the resulting explosion. Single Custodes characters fighting against a brick of Drukari. Saint Celestine punching an airplane in half. And Skitari assassins blundering hordes of Tyranids. But this video is more than just us talking about the big final clash we had to set off the edition. And we want to take this moment to highlight and appreciate just how far this game and hobby has come. And how much of a wonderful journey it's been for us. I myself painted a ton of not just individual models, but whole armies. At least two Death Guard armies, Night Lords, Flawless Host, my Chaos Knights army, some Tyranids, White Scars, I added to my, my ever-growing guard collection. Now, honestly, I don't even think that was all of it. What about you, Lane? How much stuff did you paint throughout the edition? I spent lots of the edition painting up new plastic incubi, getting Corsairs ready, and repainting a lot of my Drukhari Force to get up to a more uh, high quality of paint, as well as practicing for league games, spending lots of time going to tournaments and going to special events like that. We consider ourselves to be so fortunate to have forged such deep bonds of friendship over a mutual appreciation of this hobby. We all at Hammer Pattern hope you have also had as much fun as we have had during the ninth edition. Through its ups and downs, all of its weird interactions and crazy combos, going through a, a pandemic where the meta was up and down and all around, um, just being able to feel through this edition of 40k was really really fun for all of us uh, and we hope that you'll continue to join us as we embark on the next chapter of warhammer 40,000. this has been ryan the hammer this has been lane from hammer pattern thanks again for tuning in if you want to cause war crimes on the like button and comment on the various analytical buttons we would appreciate it the team uh, always loves to hear comments it's my only source of dopamine keep pressing those buttons stay tuned for our next video thanks bye for now